everyone, Maro Steele here from Fashion Steel NYC and welcome back to my channel and a Paris Fashion Week vlog. Make sure to give a girl a thumbs up and subscribe if you love fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel videos. All right, you guys, so we are here in Paris, flew in this morning. So we are staying here at Le Maurice Hotel in the first arrondissement and it is beautiful it's right across um from the tuileries and the louvre and it's just a beautiful hotel um so what i'll quickly do is give you guys a montage room tour and then we will come back and i'll go over my outfit because we're going to dinner tonight um, so without further ado, let's roll our stunning room footage from La Maurice. It's absolutely stunning. The all marble bathroom, it's, it's doing things. Like it's beautiful in here. The light is great for your makeup. Um, and they have just everything your heart desires. I actually called down and they sent up a rolling rack for me as well because I have tons of clothes. Um, my girl Rhea is here as well. And we are, we are turning up. We started quite early with a bottle of Chandon and or a Moet Chandon and dancing on the balcony. You can get in here, girl. I'm creeping. Hey, guys. We in here. We are in here. Cheers. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going to dinner at Costas mm -hmm. tonight. i never been, so. Lovely. I'm ready. But I've never eaten there, so I'm excited. We're excited. Um, this is my new hair. I got, um, these are kind of like by Felicia braids. <laughs> um, my girl Amani did them for me. I wanted something very light, kind of edgy, really fun. I left the ends undone and I love them. They're really giving kind of like high fashion with a twist. They're really fun and cute and they're meant to look super messy, which I like. Um, so shout out to my girl Amani. She is the same woman who did my uh, Bantu knots for New York Fashion Week. And she's great. Um, so yeah, very, very happy to be here in Paris. Um, the first few days, we're hitting the ground running tomorrow. So there are going to be quite a few Paris vlogs. So yeah, without further ado, I'm going to show you guys my outfit. And then we're going to head out for the night. I am wearing on my lip ColourPop Limbo. One of my favorite like matte browns. I just did a very easy breezy makeup look. The top is, where is this top from? Oh, this is from Zara. This little cropped hood, this little cropped 
black crop top is from Zara. I think I showed you guys I got it in a few colors. And then the skirt is my Rick Owens sequin skirt. I wore this during New York Fashion Week. This had to be worn again. Like, I gotta get my, my cost per wears. Um, let me show you the shoes. They're gonna be new in from Lueve. You might have peeped them in the previous vlog. And we're gonna head out. So, yeah, let me take you guys with me. Rhea and I have just been having a time. We've been in here dancing, doing our makeup. Yeah. I'm not sure if the light is as good. Oh, it's not bad in here. Let me show you guys my little rolling rack with all of my things. So, yeah, they brought us a rolling rack and a bunch of hangers. So, I was able to kind of hang up all of my clothes for Paris Fashion Week. You guys will see all of these outfits over the next couple of vlogs. But yeah, these are my new shoes. They are so cute. So these are my new shoes in from Loewe. They are the balloon heels. And I got them in the largest size, which is a 41. They also come in white and red with the balloon being red. But they're so comfortable. And really, really just like fun and cute. You guys know Loewe is one of my favorite brands. So happy to have these. I went to the ends of the earth looking for them. All right, guys. So here's the look. Just kind of like chill on the top, sparkle on the bottom, and a little crazy for the footwork. But yeah. By the way, thanks for all the love on this skirt when I wore it during... New York Fashion Week, everyone really liked it. So, yeah, that's the look. I think for the bag, I'm gonna take either this Jacquemus, but most likely I'm gonna take my gold Fendi first because she never gets enough love. All right, and that's the look. Oh, I forgot to show you guys how I organized the closets. I think tonight we're going to go with Tay Noir mixed with the Zara fragrance, Unusual Fruit. A lot of you bought this and said that you like it, so yay. But this is a really great mixture. Now we're ready for a night on the town. Perfect. Hotel Coastis. It is Coast. Coast. The service, trash. <laughs> <laughs> the food, great. Nice. Um, the ambiance, very sexy, very lovely. And then? <laughs> and then? <laughs> and then? <laughs> we were directly across from. Literally next to. Right next to. Could reach out and touch Brad Pitt. Who I recognized from the back of his head. <laughs> who ridiculous. turned all the way around and was like. Who are they? Direct eye contact. Direct eye contact. <laughs> and not only Brad, but Ooh. also Leo. Leo. Okay. V. Like <laughs> Leonardo DiCaprio. Um, so night made. So random. So random. But I love it. I'm here for it. It was wonderful. First night. It's getting a 
to a great start. <laughs> like, I feel like the rest of this is just gonna be even better. So I'm gonna end tonight, <laughs> and we will check in tomorrow. See you later. everyone welcome to day two of the Paris vlog so we are up we're in our robes took a few photos in those robes and they brought us breakfast we get I guess free what's well, not free is paid for eventually um, daily American breakfast with all of the fixings and they brought it to our room so we're gonna eat and then we're gonna head to basically my first event or our first event of Paris Fashion Week, which is the Farfetch Suite. You guys know I work with Farfetch quite a bit, um, and they have a suite here in Paris where we can come check out what's new. We can e even borrow um, a few pieces to wear dur during Paris Fashion Week. They have a lounge there and an on-site photographer. I actually went to the same suite when they had it in New York, not last season, but the season before last. Um, so yeah, that should be nice. And I'll take you guys with me. And then I have one presentation as well in the evening. And I think Nigel's going to join us for that too. I think he gets in today. So, let's see. Alright guys, so we're about to head to the Farfetch Suite. Um, it's pretty laid back, so I want to show you my look for today. I'm wearing this camouflage New York Yankee hat. The lip is Fenty. It's a really nice red. This sweater, I believe it's from Boohoo or Nasty Gal, but it's the open back like cross sweater. Um, and then I'm wearing my leggings from Lululemon. They are stirrups. And then the boots are my Loewe denim boots. Let me show you the full look. All right, so here's the full look. I'll link these leggings down below. They are stirrups and they're great for winter. They have fleece on the inside. Um, yeah, and I love these boots. I got them in a 41. They're really cool. So that's the look for today, just to go pull some clothes and check out what Farfetch has. Oh, the scent today, we went with, we went with Tay Noir 29 mixed with the Unusual Fruit from Zara. Um, and today's bag, we're going to do my Chanelica. And that's the look. All right guys, so we are in the car and we are heading to Farfetch, it's raining. But that's okay because we have a trusty La Maurice umbrella, which I will be keeping. I paid for this umbrella. My blood, sweat, and tears. <laughs>
right guys I'm gonna try on a few of these looks here I do have a far fetch code that you all can use it's for 12% off of any items including if they're on sale and this is for new and existing customers so yeah let's try on a few of these things here I am loving this So we just spent some time shooting a few campaigns. Of course, the work never stops. Um, we really enjoyed the Farfetch house. They're sweet and loud, just really cool. You can get your makeup done there, your hair done. They had uh, breakfast and lunch, snacks, and we got to check out and try on and shoot a few clothing items, which is really cool. We are back at the hotel. Um, and now we're gonna head down to just the area downstairs. They have like a restaurant down there and a bar. Um, and we're just gonna knock out a little bit of work before heading to the first presentation of Paris Fashion Week. So yeah, let's get some work done. Um, mingle, use these credits. We have like a daily credit that we can use every day. Um, and then come back here, we'll get ready for the first presentation and we'll head out. All right guys, so we did a little bit of work down at the bar downstairs. Um, I changed it to this Frankie Shop blazer, added this Fendi denim wristlet. I have on the same pants and boots. And we're gonna head to the first Paris Fashion Week presentation, which is CDCF. Yeah, I believe. I might have inverted the letters. Anywho, <laughs> taking you guys with me should be fun. just leaving the CFCO uh, presentation and I know about this brand from Essence because I shop on Essence so much and they usually have a lot of like emerging and up-and-coming brands on that website but all of their clothing clothing uses recycled materials like recycled polyester I think they even use plastic and some of their pieces to make their clothing extra like stretchy and pliable they do a lot of these like bell shapes I think that's their uh, signature from their very first collection and the clothes just look cool they look very comfortable you can see how the models were like dancing and moving around very futuristic and they have a few pieces that are also um they look almost transparent like there's nothing there because of the gaps they use between the fabric which is cool 
so yeah it was a cool presentation for our first paris fashion week show it was at palais de tokyo which is where a lot of the shows are so i will probably be back in this location soon but yeah now we are going to rest maybe catch up on a little bit of work we're done with all the things we had planned for today and we'll probably do you know some eiffel tower content and maybe dinner tonight so i'll check in with you guys soon all right guys so we just ate a little dinner and we're going to attempt to head to the eiffel tower and get some shots um this is going to be the first time you guys really see her up close and personal so i'm going to take you guys with me i'm wearing this dress from hanifa's latest collection love this dress it's so beautiful and we'll see if we can get some nice shots we're out here in the cold sparkling sparkling and shining <laughs> trying to get little miss eiffel we gonna see how it go all right i'm taking vlog footage on this camera she's getting her footage with the phone and then we're getting photos all in the five minutes that it stays on so we'll see how it goes i'll insert the photos but the light is amazing all right guys it is bright and early pretty much day three in paris heading to my second show of paris fashion week which is fodder it was started by um two people one is from carousel a young black man and another is from dr um so the collection has a very kind of caribbean feel it's very unique kind of over the, over the top they do mostly menswear but they've also dabbled in women's wear they've won tons of awards here in uh, paris um, and i think they also did a show for nina ritchie so it should be really good um and we're gonna head there
We are heading back to La Maurice. Heading Me and back. Nigel. Hey. Get over here. Oh, Make it. sure you guys check out Color Magazine. Please do. I'll put it here. <laughs> so what did you think of the show? Uh, you know what? I actually liked it. I love the styling of the show, like the cardigan with the sleeve wrapped around the neck to hold it up. That was yeah. women's wear. I love the women's wear with the heart cutouts. You with that button right there, like yeah, the blazer. Very cool. It's opened up a little risque, but very, very cool. The water balloon gloves. The water balloon gloves got me. They have the iceberg, um, little like handbag. It was, it was very really futuristic cute. with the the waist packs that have like the little bulb in the back. So it's like you wearing a fanny pack, but mm -hmm. you wear it backwards. Mm -hmm. That was cool. Um, it was very kind of futuristic. That was very really nice. Very yeah, nice. Yeah, and the sneakers too. Uh, which are like some dress shoe on top of like some cleats. Yeah. They were stomping they down were the stomping. runway. <laughs> <laughs> it was cool though. I think it was a more from some of the past shows I've seen from them. This is more commercial. Like I feel like people could wear this. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah. And so that's the rundown of the show. It was cool. It was cool. Now make sure you yeah. like, comment, and subscribe because. <laughs> Period. I know a lot of y'all didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Period. All right, so we'll check back in. I think we're going to try and do some Dior street style. Yeah. All right, guys. Later. Okay. Here in these Paris streets. Out here in these Parisian oh, we, rues. We. <laughs> Out in these Parisian rues. Okay, because who is that Rue Saint Jacques? Back in the room. Time for breakfast. Time for breakfast. Time for breakfast. Time for Right, guys so Rhea and I and Nigel too we went to check out just outside of Dior because it's right across the street from our hotel saw the sights saw the people took some photos um, I changed into this diesel look it's a diesel sweatshirt dress with 
my Alaya boots and my Dior bag. Um, and we are gonna head to the Pete Delart uh, presentation and then to Cochet. Um, and then we have a little break before heading to the Carl Loves, Car I mean, Cara Loves Carl party tonight. So yeah, very eventful evening. It's been a fun day so far. So let's go check out the next presentation. Um, the last time I was here in Paris, I went to their showroom and it was incredible. Like I love the accessories. I'm really looking forward to seeing the, um, the ready to wear. All right, we're here to check out Pete's Jeweler. It should be good. I'm looking forward to it. even pete it was great it's always kind of edgy very young really light and flowy materials they use a lot of pearls um and like brass and crystals for like buttons and things and to add embellishments in their clothing i love their dresses right made of very thin material that's pleated they had about three dresses like that stunning i love all of their jewelry all of their jewelry is statement jewelry um handmade every piece and they use a lot of pearls you probably saw throughout the collection that they use pearls on clothing they use pearls in their um earrings all like pearl materials and then in their shoes they use a lot of brass um and metals to add embell embellishments to an otherwise like plain shoe um and they also had a pair of sunglasses that were really cool, but I definitely love their clothes. They're very, very me, very whimsical, very light, very airy, um, kind of like under the sea type. So yeah, very cool collection. I always enjoy checking them out. So now we are in a car, we're headed to Cloche, and we are gonna check out that show. And then we're gonna rest, and then we're going to a party tonight. So on to the next.
All right guys, a super quick dinner before the party. We don't know if the party will have food. We're starving. Have some spaghetti bolognese and pizza and a cute little flower. Hey y'all. So we are dressed and ready. We're about to head to the Cara Loves Carl Passion Paris Fashion Week party. I'm wearing this Indigo Studio dress. Gonna wear my clear Chanel bag, pay a little homage. I actually believe this was Carl's last collection. Yeah, it was. Um, and I'm pairing that with boop, my Bottega Veneta Clear Mules. They're a little low, they're comfy. Um, and we're gonna head out. Let's go. Here's the full look. Indigo Studio dress. You guys saw me wear this during uh, New Year's Eve. And that's it. Trying to find something to do. <laughs> we just came from something. We we trying to find some milk. We don't want the night to end. To do. Actually. We are chasing the night. Oh no! Don't ever say that. We're chasing it. <laughs> 